Three things you need to know today. First, a vehicle struck a seven-year-old girl in Lancaster City Thursday morning. Officials said the girl was crossing the street along Conestoga Street. It's near Beaver Street at 845. City Fire Battalion Chief Ken Barton said the girl was walking to Carter McRae Elementary School. He said the incident bruised the girl's head, caused pain to her right leg, and a road rash on her right foot. Lancaster County Prison was placed in lockdown for two hours Wednesday because of high levels of carbon monoxide. Prison staff measured levels as high as 112 parts per million, and fire fi firefighters measured levels of 20 or 25 parts per million. The Occupational Safety and Health Organization permits U.S. workers to be exposed to an average carbon monoxide level of up to 50 parts per million. Officials said there were no reports of anyone feeling sick or injuries, and they don't know what caused the elevated levels of the gas. Republican presidential nominee Donald Trump will hold a rally at the Giant Center in Hershey Friday night. Doors open at 4 and the rally is scheduled to begin at 7. The visit will be Trump's second in Pennsylvania this week. He spoke with his running mate Governor Mike Pence and King of Prussia on Tuesday. That's going to do it for us today. Make sure to check out our website Lancaster Online to follow us on social media. I'm Irene Snyder. Have a great day. At Lancaster General Health, we are here to keep this community healthy and well to give you every option to live the life you want to live. That's why we've joined Penn Medicine, Pennsylvania's number one ranked health system, to bring you local access to the world's most advanced research and one-of-a-kind clinical trials that are leading to one-of-a-kind cures. Your life is our legacy, and to us, that's worth everything.